Sancho Shea and welcome or welcome back. If you are an only but a goodie, you already know how I feel about you guys. I love y'all oh so much. And if you are a new viewer, please be sure to subscribe, like, comment down below, and share, share, share this video with any and everyone because guess what? Sharon is Karen. All right, y'all, so if you can tell by the title, you already know what I'm about to do. It's about time to get into the fragrances I wore last week, boo. So let's just jump right on in. <laughs> All right, y'all, so what is this to wear on Sunday? Now, Sunday, boo, I just, you know, it was all about my gingham love. I just wanted to use this on Sunday, okay? So, gingham love has sugar red berries, blushing freesia, and rose meringue. And it smelled good. Is it one of it is it my favorite from gingham? No. But it smells really good. So I wanted to use this. So this was my inspiration for the day. So I was looking around for some berry scents. And at the time, I really didn't find any berry scents. So I just went in with my cherry because I didn't think that my berry blast pink sugar would have went with this. But now that I'm thinking about it, it might would have. So I'm, maybe next time I use this, I'll pair it with the berry blast from pink sugar so gingham love is what i spray my body down with and i know i'm going out of order because usually i start with my body wash or bar soap so i went in with the cherry and chai milk and this is from dove and i love me some dove who loves some dove raise your hand boo raise your hand in the comment section and put a purple heart if you love dove okay so went in with that and this bad boy smells good too mm. It doesn't smell to me as good as the scrub for this, but it smells good nonetheless. So went in with that. Then when I got out, I actually paired these two together. And if y'all have been rocking with your girl for a while, y'all know that I love me some honey almond body oil. So I paired that with the EOS Fresh and Cozy. And when I tell you that was a good time, sis, they both went well together. So I just, yeah, fresh and cozy and I need some lotion right now. So that's why I'm just going ahead and moisturize them. My hands be so dry all the time from washing and washing and washing. And I did do some dishes earlier. So that's the main reason why they're really dry. But it's just a nice fresh scent and I just like it. So I just want it like a plain, not too plain, but just like a fresh scent to go with my cherry and berries uh, that I had going on. So I rubbed down in that and then that's when I sprayed down my gingham. Mm. <laughs> that's when I sprayed down my gingham love and it smells really good. Mm. It smells really good. So, and then of course I had to top it off with a nice old perfume and I went in with my inspired by Lost Cherry from Tom Ford. But of course, it's the Dossier brand and it's or Oriental Cherry. So the top notes for this is cherry, almond, cinnamon. And then the middle notes is cloves, rose, jasmine, plum. And then the base notes are Peru, balsam, tonka bean, and vanilla. So I went in with that. So yeah, y'all, that's the scent I was going for on Sunday. So what did you guys to smell like on Monday? All right, y'all. So on Monday, your good sis wanted to, I just made up something. I'm really going to be real with y'all. I needed to use up these two scents and I, these both are empty at this point. I actually did an empties and feature these. Well, I featured this one because I actually just used this up this morning. So I featured this one in my product empties, but now I have two empty products. So I use the strawberry and vanilla toffee from the candy shop from Native. And then I use the watermelon mojito uh, moisturizing body wash from Beth and Body Works. So I use these two together just because I needed to get rid of those. And they smell good together. Strawberry and watermelon goes together. I mean, 
okay so then when i got out the shower i like this combo together so i did it one more time and it's the fresh and cozy by eos and then the honey almond oil so yeah i paired these two together and then i sprayed down my body with the Hayete. I don't even know if I'm smelling, I'm saying this correct, but this one right here, and I will put the keynotes on the screen because y'all, I don't forgot what this bad boy actually smell like, but it does smell good. It's from La Tafa brand, and it's a cheaper brand, like you know, a cheaper, more affordable. I'm gonna say that because I don't want to say cheaper, and then y'all just be like, "Ooh, well, does it smell cheap?" No, it does not smell cheap. It actually smells really good. I think all the Latafa scents that I have, which I have the link, um, the video above so you guys can actually watch that if you have not already watched it or link it down in the description box below as well. Uh, but, because I did a big old haul and this is the Gold Elixir. So Hayate Gold Elixir from Latafa. It smells really good and it's a very affordable scent and I think that it went pretty well together so that's what your good sis was smelling like on monday so yo what was your good sis smell like on tuesday boo what was she smelling like on tuesday let's see okay y'all so on tuesday what was your good sis smelling like all right so we're gonna get down with the get down so cleanse my body off with the olay cocoa butter body wash i already know how i feel about olay body wash i have almost all of them but not all of them i wanted this one so of course i went and grabbed it it smells pretty good so i washed my body down in this and then when i got out the shower i used these two together which is the honey almond oil <laughs> and amber romance so i used those two together and the amber romance is just a deep amber shirt kisses and it says chasing sunset so i really do love amber romance from victoria's secret so i paired these two together and it went very well and then i had to pull out my girl fairy tale i love me some fairy tale I think it smells so good. You can use this on its own. You don't even need to have a perfume to go with this because it's a strong scent and it mm, it just smells so good and it lasts for a while as well, especially when you spray it on your clothes. I suggest when you're spraying your body down, I spray my body down without clothes on with my spray and with my perfume. I do not break out. I mean, I know some people do break out. So this is for the people that don't break out. Um, like that like every now and then I will break out on my chest and that's usually when I'm using like different scrubs but as far as perfumes and body body sprays I have not noticed that I break out so I will spray my body down with my spray front and back and also my perfume and then when I put my clothes on majority of times I lay out my clothes on the bed and I will spray them down front and back with body spray and my perfume and it just i don't care if that i'm over spraying because it's my spray it's my perfumes i'm gonna use as much as i want and i want the scent to last for a while if you just spray down poop poop and that's about it nine times out of ten you're not it's not gonna linger on for a while unless it's a very very strong scent then it will last four hours but other than that i mean that's just what i do so that's just a little tip so for the perfume i use my private gold it's confidential private gold from la Tafa. so i use that and i paired it with my fairy tale so boom boom these went together and this smells really good like these scents really smell like a rich <laughs> babe i'm gonna say rich babe i ain't gonna say the other word but I really do think that these smell like they just elevate like they smell like boss babe or rich babe okay I really do think they smell like that and these are unisex scents so men can wear them as well so that's what you good sis wore on Tuesday okay y'all so what did you good sis wear on Wednesday boo now Wednesday I went in with my OGX favorite and it's the coconut coffee I had to. I love this thing so so much. Oh my gosh, it just smells so good. If you guys have not tried it, because I know a lot of you have tried it, but if you guys have not, the ones in the back, 
maybe y'all in the front i mean get close babe get close the ones in the front that have not tried this bad boy i need y'all to go to walmart target drugstore get you a og x coconut coffee but you gotta like coffee scents like <laughs> if you don't like coffee scents you probably won't even gravitate towards this but just grab it up i'm just saying because it just smells so good and it has a little coffee grinds in it so it's actually exfoliating while you're scrubbing down your body okay so went in with that and then i had to come out with my with my duo my honey almond oil and my smoothie body butter uh smoothie star body butter by soap and glory i love this now as y'all can see because i've been using the heck out of this thing i even used it today with my scent of the day but we ain't talking about what i wore today we talking about last week boo so ah uh, i just love this and i have of course the body wash and i love it too and the body scrub but yeah mm -mm. this is what i uh, moisturize my body with and it smells so good and i just love the way they pair together so the smoothie star is scented with almond and vanilla y'all already know how i feel about almond and at this point how i feel about vanilla because i love both of those scents and i love my coffee scent and coconut like mm, all of it just meshing so well together they just smell so good so came out uh moisturized down with that duo and then i have my almond blossom and oat milk from victoria's secret i love this now, I do have the uh, Bath & Body Works Almond Blossom, and I think that smells so good. This one smells so good, too. Like, I like them both separately. You know what I mean? Like, I don't... Mm, mm. I just got to have both in my life. I got to have the Almond Blossom from BBW, and I need to have the Almond Blossom and Oat Milk from VS. Okay? Mm, it just smells so good. I'm telling you. So I spray my body down with this. And of course, I spray my clothes down with that as well. And then I paired two perfumes together. My Be Seduced Girl by Johan B. So I did this with my K. Ali uh, Vanilla 28. I paired these two together, boo. And when I tell you it smells oh so good, the whole concoction, boo, smells so good to me. I love me some Beast of These Girl. And I got this from Rebel. They have it on um, Amazon as well and other places too. But this is a cheap uh, perfume. This is a 3.4 and you can get this for less than $30. So I paired these bad boys up and that's what your good sis was wearing on Wednesday. Okay. So what was your good sis wearing on Thursday, boo? What was she wearing on Thursday? All right, y'all. So I tried Cremo for the first time and I got it in the Spiced Amber. I got this from Walmart. I just think it smells so good. And this can definitely be a unisex scent. It's a unisex scent because boo, I'm wearing it. So it's unisex. Boo, uh-uh, honey. We sharing, okay? So, <laughs> if my boo ain't got this boo, guess what? We sharing this bad boy. Nah, I'll get my own. But I'm just saying. Mm, this smells so good to me. So, I tore this thing up. I mean, I, I didn't make a dent in it. I mean, it was just my first time using it. But it suds up very well. So, I do like that. And I just, it just look, mm, it smells so good to me. So, Wash my body down with the Spice Amber from Cremo. And then I went in with my Warm Sugar Cookie Body Oil. And I paired it with who? With the Smoothie Star Boo. Yes, I paired these together. And when I tell you it's a good time, this Warm Sugar Cookie. And this is actually from, goodness, from Royal Black Cosmetics. So if you guys have tried this. I'm just telling you, it smells good. I need to order some more items from that brand. It just smells so good. So I paired those two together to moisturize my body down. And when I tell you I was nice and moisturized, boo, I was nice and moisturized, okay? So then I uh, sprayed my body down. I didn't even use a body 
spray for this. Nope, I didn't even use a body spray. I'm just looking down at my notes that's in my phone for Thursday. And I use the fruit, uh, the fruity brown sugar. And I forgot which perf perfume this is inspired by. Um, and this is from Dossier. And the top notes is bergamot, raspberry, and pear. The middle notes is jasmine, orange blossom, brown sugar. The base notes is patchouli, amber, and vanilla. And then I just put me some vanilla must from the Nemat, N-E-M-A-T. I got this from Ulta. This little bottle was like, I'm going to tell you, it was about 20 bucks. If I'm not mistaken, it was like 20 bucks. Like, I thought I was balling buying this. Like, what? I don't know, but I put a few drops on my wrist and I just rubbed that bad boy in. And then, of course, I sprayed my fruity brown sugar on top of it. And like I've said before, I spray my body down with my perfumes and body sprays. And then I spray my clothes down with the same. So that, you know, once it dries off your skin, because after a while it will die down and the scent won't hardly be there anymore. It will just be faint. Or it won't be there at all. But when it's on your clothes, boo, it's there for a while. So, anywho, so that's what I wore on Thursday. All right, y'all. So, what did you guys this wear on Friday, boo? Friday, I went in with my Caress Mango and Almond Oil. This is, well, it's from Caress. I bought it from Walmart. So, I went in with this. Y'all know I'm a big Caress fan. The top ones that I love is the Daily Silk, which has the white peach up in that thing. Um, another one that I really love so much is the Shea Butter one. It used to be called, I think, Goddess or I think something like that, like Goddess back in the day. But it's the brown sugar one, brown sugar and Shea Butter. It smells so good to me and it's the exfoliating one. Another one that I like is the Black Orchid and patchouli that smells really good too so yes y'all i added this to my collection so i washed my body down really good with this and then i went in with the moisturizer and i've been loving this as y'all can see i've been you know putting a little teeny dent into this hemp sugar cane and papaya this really does my body good and i'm so glad i found it at tj maxx it was only 12.99 Versus the $20 that you're going to spend if you go to Ulta or anywhere else. It's like $20 or more. So, I was glad I found this and I smelled it in the store. So, I'm like, mm-hmm, this is going home with me. So, basically, I mixed my warm sugar cookie because I do like to mix the oil and the lotion together. So, I moisturized my body down with these. And then I sprayed my body down with one of my favorites, which is Fall and Bloom, boo. Fall and Bloom. Okay, so this one has Juicy Plum, Wild Blooms, and Velvet Moss. And when I tell y'all, mm, this smells good. This is like the fairy tale one. And I don't think I told y'all what this one had in it. Pomegranate, Nectar, Fresh Orange Blossom, Vanilla Bean, and Warm Amber. So when I tell y'all, these two right here could go by themselves. You don't even need to put them with a perfume, sis. Mm -hmm. And I know a lot of you guys have these because we, we be talking about it. But I just wanted y'all to know that those two go very well by themselves. Not really needed to have a perfume if you don't want one or if you don't have one that actually, you know, goes with it or whatever. But I love the way this smells. So pair that up and then I topped it off with my perfume. And this one I got from Marshalls for $14.99. And this is from Pearl Essence. It's called Bella Rosa and it's a Oude Perfume. So I got this from there and I really like this smell. I think it smells really good and I think it paired well with these and with the fall and bloom. So if you ever see this, try it. Just smell it. If you like the way it smells, grab that thing and of course, you know, put it all together however you want. But if you have fall and bloom, pair these two together and they actually like the colors match as well. But that ain't what we came here for. We just came here for a good time with these fragrances, okay? So that's what your good sis was wearing on Friday. Okay, y'all. So what was your sis wearing on Saturday, boo? What did she wear on Saturday? <laughs> anyway, let's check it out. So we started off with my Dove Body Love Night Recovery. 
And even though it was a nighttime when I used this bad boy, and it ain't ever nighttime when I use this bad boy, um, I really enjoy this. It moisturizes my body and everything. It says it has a retinol serum up in that thing. So um, it says it's for dry, worn down skin. So I guess that's why it's night recovery. So that if you are using it on a nightly basis, I mean, not just one time, it ain't gonna do nothing, but probably over time, it will help with the uh, dryness, the worn down skin, you know. It says work with skin while you sleep to boost skin's resilience for a renewed skin moisture barrier. So yeah, so I wash my body down in that. And let me see how it smells because I don't forgot. It has a nice little scent. So I went in with my honey almond oil and I did not use my body butter. I actually used Cozy Evening. Now I have not used Cozy Evening in a while. Matter of fact, I've only used it a couple times and this was like my second time using it. So it has the lavender blossoms or blooms, lavender blooms, fresh freesia, and cozy musk. All right, so I do like how this smells. It smells really nice to me. So I pair these two together. And then I went in with the cozy evening spray and that smells really good too. Uh-huh. It smells really nice. And then I top the bad boy off with my queen from B Police or 2B Police, I think is the brand. It has police on it and all of them are skulls. I got this from fragrance.net and I love this scent. It smells good to me. Let me spray it, y'all. Yes, it smells so good to me. So I topped it off with that and I just think that it went well with the cozy evening scent. And yeah, y'all, that was my scent, my fragrance layer combos for last week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up that lets me know you do enjoy these types of videos. And make sure you are subscribed, your notification bell is turned on, you are chit-chatting down below because I love the chit-chat with you guys. And also make sure that you are sharing these videos with any and every one and y'all already know that means sharing is caring. All right, y'all. So I will catch you guys in my next video. And I love you guys for watching.